hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Colin Ming welcome to another shower routine this is a nighttime shower routine we're gonna begin with removing my lace because I don't like sleeping on the lace and then afterwards you're gonna move to just like securing our hair and yeah remove the makeup which I'm using my cellar water this is like my go-to makeup remover it does the job it gets everything done can you see like oh and then now i'm gonna go with i think it's pronounced as codely from cleanser honestly on a normal day i don't use any of these products i just use stuff soap but when i'm removing my makeup i just like to properly cleanse and we're gonna move into the shower this is like a nighttime smell good shower routine and dove is always my go-to shower jar and i love it it lathers so nicely it has like this silk feeling on your skin i don't know if i should say silk but it's so good guys make sure you scrub your feet because some people out there they be like oh we don't wash your feet the water just runs down through it no make sure you scrub in between the toes everything and now i'm just rinsing off Now I'm using my Dove soap to just wash my armpits and my lady bits. Um, I don't use feminine wash guys. For those that want to use feminine wash, I would just like recommend to speak to your gyno first because it's not always recommended and I've never had any issues or using the Dove soap down there. And now, oh my gosh, thanks to Lyco for actually gifting me this product. Guys, I've seen the US girlies use Tree Heart and I've been so excited. I did my research and this vitamin C was like one of them a lot of people recommended and I love it. It smells amazing. For anyone that actually want to start or try out Tree Heart products, I would definitely try it. So I'm just scrubbing and it's not that harsh on the skin and it leaves you like, you know, super moisturized which is one thing that i love and back again i'm just rinsing just making sure i rinse everything because sometimes there's just like some small particles left over so even though i cleanse my face before i just love to use dove soap because that's like literally my staple i just can't bear the thought of not washing with dove soap so yeah this is just what i'm doing and guys like I said, I barely use any products on my face. All I use is this soap because I have clear skin, so there's no need to use the products all the time. One product that I picked up was this foam wash from um, Lyco as well. And oh my gosh, I love it. One thing that I would say, I wouldn't recommend it to use just on its own. I would maybe use like a... Um, shower jar and then use this as an afterwash if you get what i mean because now also what i noticed it says on the label you can use it just like you know as a shower foam or also to shave because usually when i shave i don't use anything but i decided to try it and it was okay it was okay honestly um yeah that's all i'll say and now i'm rinsing again yeah guys i don't do this every day by the way it's just like you know i think i've exfoliated three times a week now we are drying ourselves and getting to the exciting part because yeah we're gonna do skincare i love this pixie and as you can see it's like personalized because i usually get like you know pr from pixie i love this glow tonic this is like one of the all time good products even when i've given my friends some they've loved it it has done wonders for the skin so i'll definitely recommend this product like you know as a toner even my mom likes it i think i sent her one and then i'm just going on with roll on oh yeah this one it smells like the perfume alien and my staple dove lotion that specific blue package i recommend it and that's like one of the products that does wonders for my face because if I use other products, they don't really work on me. 
and again moisturize the lips and i'm just going to spray some maria badescu cucumber spray don't do this every day but yeah and now another product that i got gifted from lyco is brazilian pom pom cream i have been seeing a lot of people talking good things about it people say it's not really moisturizing for example on dark skin i feel like it's okay for my skin but what i notice on my face it's not the best it's quite pricey it's a splurge but i feel like it's good it's okay it's okay i love the smell and guys that's me trying out my gua sha wait it's the rolly thing whatever you call it i'm gonna try the gua sha afterwards I bought it on Aliexpress. I was like, why not? It just basically, what does it do? Again, okay, jeez, I'm gonna check later on. But yeah, um, I forgot, jeez. But yeah, anyway, just trying it, and I didn't know what I was doing. I watched a few TikToks to just, you know, I feel like it lifts your face. I don't know, circulates blood. I ain't got no clue. But you know what? I'm always open to trying new stuff. And guys those pajamas are from shein can you believe it i'm gonna leave everything down in the link below and yeah i was just like listening to lofi music which was like literally vibe but yeah that's it guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe and share with a friend and yeah all the products are down below like i said but bye guys if you've made it this far you are the realest Mwah.